craft of engraving is hundreds of years old, and this man has been in the trade for the past half century. Martin Reiling is a master engraver, and he says hand engraving produces the best results. It's more durable. It has a different structure than a machine produces. Machines stamp or grind. When we engrave, we cut the material. Reiling creates the Baroque-style Viennese engraving on pens. As far as hand engravers who are capable of doing that, we think there are four or five in Germany. Thankfully, we have one of them here. We're very happy about that. It's a unique feature of a product series from our collection, and it's very much in demand. Each pen is unique. Stefan Schnirsch has managed the company for eight years. The company places a lot of importance on handcraft. Many processes have remained unchanged for decades. Sterling silver is pre-cut, pressed into shape, and polished. Waldman produced 120,000 pens this year. That's a lot of work for their 20 employees. And things always get a little hectic in the months before Christmas. That really only works, or only worked this year, with a lot of overtime. We work Saturdays and during the week from half past six in the morning to five or six p.m. The company is looking to hire four more workers, but they're not that easy to find. There are plenty of good employers in southern Germany, and people tend to stay put. Maria Stammel has been putting pens together for half her life. I've been doing it for 25 years. We're a family. The handmade pens are a luxury product. Sure, it's a premium product. It's not something the average person has at home. Waldman aims to outdo its competitors with special commissions. Pens like this, for example, were sold to clients in Dubai. <laughs> It has a portrait of Sheikh Al Maktoum, here with the Burj Khalifa, or the Burj Al Arab, Dubai's main landmarks. This was a small production run which we delivered. And what do they cost? Well, if you had to buy it, then I imagine you'd need more than five or six hundred euros. Some of the most loyal customers come from the car industry. An expensive car comes with some expensive extras. We had a nice order from Rolls-Royce. They sent us the leather they were using in their cars, and we turned it into a complete pen. And these were given to customers who bought a Rolls. <laughs> The pens are polished after every manufacturing step. Polishing is another time-honored handcraft. Expensive pens need to shine. The company sells its hand-engraved pens in more than 60 countries. Artistic craftwork, made in Germany. <laughs>